I'm on a journey to understand more about circularity. Instead of the current linear economy where we take resources, make a product, and then dump it, the circular economy is one based on designing waste out of systems. In this episode, I'll be investigating Evian's pledge to become 100% circular by 2025. Just 14% of plastic packaging is collected for recycling worldwide. Much of the rest ends up in our ocean, doing immense harm to the environment and even finding its way into our own food chain. I'm traveling to Evian Les Bains to find out about Evian's pledge to become fully circular by 2025. How do you define circularity? So circularity for us is this, is that bottles will become bottles again. So today we are using 25% of recycled plastic in our bottles and we have a roadmap to become 100%. What led Evian to pledge to become fully circular by 2025? At Evian, we owe everything to nature. We are coming from these magnificent mountains and we need to preserve these natural resources from the next generations. That's why we want to become plastic neutral by 2025. We already announced that by 2020, we will be carbon neutral globally. And this is one step further on our sustainability commitment. To what extent does Evian feel responsible for the plastic already in our oceans? The water bottle category is increasing because there is an increasing demand from the consumers to provide healthy hydration to compete against other kind of beverage that has a lot of sugar. Today, we have reduced almost two million and a half bottles since 5.30 a.m. in the morning. So what for us is key is that we need really to take our role on this to serve this demand in the most responsible and sustainable way. What technology is needed to make this happen? Today we have identified a new technology that is able to take plastic waste and transform this into plastic with the highest quality that we need for our bottles. It's called Loop Industries. Made using fossil fuels, the way plastic is currently produced, used and dumped is extremely damaging to our environment. I'm here in Montreal to meet Daniel Solomita, founder of Loop Industries, to find out how his team's new technology hopes to bring plastic production into the circular economy. Come on, I'll show you around. That expression, someone else's trash is someone else's gold. I was always very interested in trying to create value out of waste, and I was always very environmentally conscious. Our technology takes waste and makes two petrochemicals. Everyone else in the world manufactures these two out of fossil fuels, terephthalic acid and monoethylene glycol. These are the two base ingredients that go into making PET plastic. So this can be turned into an Evian water bottle. What our technology does is we take waste plastic that nobody else can recycle. We remove the petrol from petrochemicals and turn that into a very high quality plastic. We're gonna be building multiple facilities in Europe to provide Evian with the plastic that they need for their packaging. If you wanna hand me the plastic, and we'll start the process. <laughs> I put this in as well? Yeah, just pour yours in. We'll put in our mixture of chemicals, and you'll actually see what it looks like breaking down the plastic into the petrochemical base. This is what the solids look like after the depolymerization. So this is the material that no one else will be able to recycle because of all this mm -hmm. non-PET material. But there's still a lot that you are able to recycle. Yeah, clearly, so all the other solids yeah. are all what we want. That's what we need to purify. Loop Industries technology is the essence of circularity. So we need the brands to put up the global infrastructure and the consumers to do the right thing and put that package into the recycling bins so that we can flow that through our process. We cannot solve this issue alone. We need competitors to move forward. We need governments to increase recycling initiatives. We need everybody. Despite us knowing the impact of single-use plastic on our oceans and on our environments, our consumption is set to hit half a trillion bottles a year by 2021. But within this context, I think it is really important that companies are starting to rethink how they produce plastic. In the next episode, I'll explore how consumers can play their part in the circularity system. Mm -hmm.